Is that a golden queen peach? I think it is. Woohoo! The golden queen peaches are here. My favorite fruit. I love a golden queen peach. Bloody marvelous. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Pi. I hope you've had a bloody marvelous day. I always look forward to this time of year when the golden queen peaches season starts. They're always a little expensive at the beginning and then they get cheaper and I can get my full of golden queen peaches for another year. Bloody marvellous. All right, up early in time for the Hui Tima at 8.30 this morning. Our first major one of the year, I guess, where we all come together and discuss uh, things of interest, obviously, uh, getting ready for the uh, new year was uh, figured pretty highly on the agenda. Um, a few things that we've got to be very careful about is the change that's occurring, a lot of change um, likely to happen, uh, especially around the COVID uh, situation. So, yeah, a lot of discussion about that and about how we can be quite flexible. Uh, I had to put forward my proposal for the induction this year, which again, uh, flexibility was the key. Um, I think I got across my story reasonably well. Um, we'll have to wait for the feedback now and uh, see where we can go from there. So uh, that was done and then I sort of spent the rest of the day uh, tidying up uh, things associated with that, just getting in touch with people and just trying to uh, get that all organised. So, yeah, once that was done, um, I did a little TikTok um, filming in my, in my lunch break just with the Golden Queen peaches, which I'd sort of planned from the day before. So that um, didn't take up too much time. And I also mowed a, a little bit of lawn as well just to have a bit of a break. And it was during that um, lawn mowing bit that I came up with an idea um, for the induction just to keep it all on track, which I think is, um, yeah, going to be really good. So I'm quite uh, quite pleased about that. And then I got a little bit of lawn mode as well. And then it was just a matter of um, I had a little bit of tea. Oh, uh, yes, I, I packaged and got about nine hats, I think, eight or nine hats ready to go out in the mail. So um, that's going to happen over the next couple of days so that um, yeah, there's quite a bit of um, time involved in that and so we've got that and we'll be sending those out so yeah I had a pretty solid day I was pretty pleased with how things went actually bloody marvellous today's time ta -ba 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 -ba. today's background a time lapse from the deck the front little piece of lawn was mowed, 1,443 steps, 8 hours of admin, and the weight in the 84s. Very pleasing. Which was the first planet discovered with the use of a telescope? Answers in the comments below the video, please. A superlative effort from David of Desmond's Dondas to combine all of the four possible answers there into one sentence and indicate that a baby pigeon is called a squab is no mean feat. And he managed to achieve it, so thoroughly deserves his place on the Hall of Fame today. Bloody marvellous David of Desmond's Donders. Thank you very much for your support of my channel. Such a pleasure to have you here. Bloody marvellous. Check out Desmond's Dondas for some great drone footage and commentary in and around the countryside of the United Kingdom. Bloody marvellous. Feel legit.
This has been a Mario presentation, recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud, a place where Kiwis live in a paradise we like to call God's own country.